In this video, you'll learn how to troubleshoot issues with your smart spools in your method series printer. The material spools compatible with the BakerBot method have a black plastic hub. This contains an RFID chip that communicates with the hardware in your printer. The RFID hub will allow a method to display the type of material that's loaded at the time, as well as the color, any amount of material remaining on the smart spool. If you've loaded a MakerBot smart spool into one of the material bays, but notice that no material is detected, there may be an issue with the RFID hub in the spool. The first thing you should try to do is insert a different spool into the bay. For example, if you've inserted a spool of SR30 into bay 2, and notice a detection failure, we recommend using a second spool of SR30 to test whether the issue is related to the spool itself, or whether there's a larger issue with your method series printer. If you don't have a second spool to test with, you can insert your model material into bay 2 to verify that the bay recognizes the model material. If you find that you're only noticing that no material detected with one spool of material, contact MakerBot support through our website, support.makerbot.com, and we can replace the RFID hub for you. If you find that the material bay doesn't recognize other spools you have, there may be an issue with the material bay. You can check the connections to the RFID reader on the underside of the material bay. To find the connections, make sure that the bay is open as far as it can go and look underneath the drawer. Inspect these connections to make sure they're secure. Once it's confirmed that the connection is secure, close the materials bay and latch it shut. After inspecting the cable connections, try loading material again. If the material is still not being recognized, you can power cycle the method in order to restart the electronics. To do this, press and hold the power button for 8 seconds. You should see the method interface power down, then restart shortly thereafter. Once the method is booted back up, try loading material again. If you have any other questions or issues, feel free to contact MakeitBot support at 844-226-8871 or online at support.makerbot.com.